Hello, I'm Jill here, and um, I drew out 15 sketchbooks so far, and somebody told me I should do a coloring book, somebody told me I should do Jonah. I gave up quite a few books out this weekend. If you want any books, I get them pretty cheap off of Amazon for author's copies. Just get a hold of me, write a comment or anything, I don't care. Um, so it's good to get the word out. Read the word, get it into you, sing it, draw it, whatever it takes. Um, so sorry if this lawnmower's not going away, but we'll just carry on. Keep on carrying on. Care. Uh, so yesterday we read about the Good Samaritan. So somebody was robbed. I think it was a Jewish person. Uh, and laying in the pit, and a priest walked by, a Levite walked by, and a Samaritan stopped and took care of the person. So, who, which of these three do you think was a good neighbor to him who fell into the hands of robbers? I hope you can hear me, the one who had mercy on him. So be a good neighbor, take care of those around you. Go and do the same, show mercy. So this is me, this is you. This is the lawyer walking away. So Luke 10, 38. As Jesus and his disciples were on their way, he came to a village where a woman named Martha opened her home to him. She had a sister called Martha. Whoops. A woman named Mary, I believe, opened her home. I need to change that. Her home to him. She had a sister called Martha who sat at the Lord's feet listening to what he said so Mary's like come on in come in Jesus I, I believe this is Mary welcome oh no okay let's do this again as Jesus and his disciples were on their way he came to a village where a woman named Martha opened her home to him let's just say I got this right and this is Martha come on in Jesus she had a sister called Mary Sorry, cross that out, put Mary. Who sat at the Lord's feet. Sorry, the S is crossed out. Mary sat at the Lord's feet listening to what he said. Sister Mary, Jesus is preaching the word. Martha's saying, welcome to Jesus and his disciples. Okay. First off, Martha's having Jesus and the disciples come in, sit down. Then Jesus gives the word and Sister Mary is sitting at his feet. But Mary was distracted by the big dinner preparations that had to be made. Cook the food, clean the house, do this, do that, set the table. She came to him and asked, Lord, don't you care that my sister has left me to do the work by myself? Tell her to help me. And Jesus said to her and answered her, Martha, Martha, you are worried about many things, but one thing is needed. And Mary, with a Y, has chosen that good part which will not be taken away from her. So here's the good part which was cut off. We want the good part that hasn't been cut away from us. So there's many interpretations of this, but let's be Mary and not Martha and have a good, get through the day today with the Lord and his priorities. Okay, God bless your day. Talk to you tomorrow. It'll be Luke 11 and the Lord's Prayer. Do you know the Lord's Prayer? Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Talk to you later.